Happy Saturday. I'm getting my days mixed up. <laughs> Happy Saturday. I was home and I had an awesome idea and I thought, why not come share it with you guys, right? So I go through my mail on Saturdays. I just get a lot. And so I stack up my mail. It's over there in the corner that you guys can see. And then um, I go through it on Saturday. I got the new Oriental Trading Catalog for crafts. Now, I originally started to get this catalog when I was putting together things for my wedding. Um, I did a 5K wedding in New York, so I did a lot of things myself. And Oriental Trading was one of the companies that I used to get things for cheaper. And as I was flipping through the catalog, I was like, you know, this would be a great side hustle for somebody because this catalog features a ton of hygiene, a ton of ornaments. I hope that you guys can see them. I'm, I'm really bad at this, but it has like all these Christmassy ornament things, lots of personalized things, and lots of cuteness, just pages and pages of ornaments and crafts and just lots of ideas for things, crafts that you can do, Christmas decorations, Christmas ornaments galore, like literally pages and pages. And I love these personalized ones. Like my son did that one at daycare last year and stuff. So just a ton and ton, ton just pages of stuff. So if you are a crafter, I think that a great idea, a great little side hustle right now would be personalized ornaments um, and a pack of them. Uh, so there's so many different ideas here. So many different things. They've got like unfinished gingerbread houses. Um, they've got some wooden ones. They've got the magic inch. Uh, ink ones, some that you scratch and then it shows up. They've got magnetic, glitter, um, things that you color in. Just so, so many things that I think would be awesome if you are a crafter and if you have been thinking, what can I do that everybody else is not doing yet? This is it. <laughs> and there's so many different types. There are religious ones, there are non-religious ones. Oh, there's glitter, there's color, there's coloring, there's add photos, add your own words. Um, I'm just looking through it. There's like a, even a cute little Rubik's cube that, you know, you can color in. Um, little charm bracelet -y type of things that you can put together and make them into ornaments. So if you are a crafter, get into this. Some of these ornaments are like 35 cents an ornament, you know, 30 cents, 89 cents. You could put together a pack of personalized ornaments because think, everybody's where they're home right now, right? And if you're stuck at home with your family, you want something cute for your tree, you want some personalized gifts, um, you know, you want your family represented, they could order personalized ornaments from you. Uh, or another really popular one are the personalized um, stockings. I, like I've done it with my son and I realized that the stockings actually came from Dollar Tree because I ended up going to Dollar Tree and I saw the stockings and the person added like glued on like some, the names on the top of the stockings. And all they did was they used their Cricut machine, cut out the names, glued it on. It was great. I love supporting a crafter. Um, and where she paid like, cause I'm sure if, if you get a box of stuff from, from Dollar Tree, it's cheaper than a dollar a piece, but let's say she paid a dollar for them. And here I paid $8 a piece for each stock, personalized stocking, not a bad come up. Okay. So if you're sitting there and you're thinking, what do I do for Christmas? And you're really good at like, these are magnets. How cute are these? And then they've got the magnets where you put the kids photos in it. I hope that shows up. Let me let me do it again. Like, look. 
And if you see that, that's $10 for 12 or for the ones where you, oh, sorry, 829 for 12. And, you know, it's less than a dollar a piece. So imagine if you were charging somebody $5 an ornament for a personalized ornament, they send you the photo, you get the photo printed, you print the photo, you attach it to this, boom, there you go. All right, so, and then they've got like ginger, gingerbread, um, craft house kits. They've got gingerbread magnets. I know, I'm not a crafter, but I'm losing my mind because I love it. And I think this is a really great way for those of you who are not sure what to do, you know, this is an easy way for you to make money without a huge investment. And now is the time to start selling. Uh, Thanksgiving is next week. People start thinking of Christmas right away. So even if you like snagged a couple of photos and put them up there, threw them on Etsy, um, you know, this is a great time to make those sales. Anyway, if one of you guys tries this out, let me know. I am again using the Oriental Trading Crafts Magazine. If you go to orientaltrading.com, you can get this, or you can just order directly off their magazine. Um, they do free shipping on $39 or more. If you do $150, you get $15 off plus your free shipping. And there are literally hundreds and hundreds and hundreds of items in here. If you are not good at coming up with stuff, but you're good at putting crafts together, this is your jam, all right? Let me know if you try it. <laughs> if, you know, if this works out for you, if you've been able to make some money. And then for those of you guys who are gonna try the chocolate bombs, I'm so curious as to how it's going with you guys who did the chocolate bombs. Tag me in the group and I'd love to know how you're doing. Have a great weekend, you guys. I really just wanted to quickly share this with you and maybe give somebody else an idea of something that they could do, you know, to make some money. Have a great weekend.